happy Tuesday. I just woke up about an hour ago. It is like 7.30 now. I got up a little bit early today just because, um, I mean, I slept fine, but like, you know, first night in the new place, adjusting. Um, also, I put on sunscreen because I have this line right here. You can see where the zinc sunscreen is left along white line but I'm having some discoloration in my skin from the sun and so I'm trying to be better about that um because I was walked along the west side for a long time yesterday in the sun so yeah but um I am going this morning I'm very excited I'm going to a Pilates class outside on the rooftop at the 60 hotel in Soho um, it is called Good Day Pilates. They're like an Australian based, I think, um, Pilates studio based here in New York. And I, you know, I love New York Pilates and I'm a very devoted follower, but um, I really wanted, they're not open yet. And Good Day is open and it's on the rooftop of this hotel and it sounds amazing right up my alley. So I decided to treat myself um, and it'll be good to like. I don't know, do a class with other New Yorkers again. Um, you have to wear a mask the whole time and they have like shields between each reformer, like the big glass divider. So it feels pretty safe to me. Um, I'm really excited about it. So yeah, I, as you saw, I woke up, did my morning routine, had some hot lemon water, matcha, got dressed, just wearing this tank top from Blue Lemon, this sports bra from Aloe, these black biker shorts are from Target. And yeah, I am about to put my mask on and I'm gonna go downstairs and get an uber down because it's kind of far um but I'll probably like walk I'm gonna try and go to the flower district afterwards because I need some greens or some kind of plant life in here I'm picking up something tomorrow but um I want something today so we will see um I made a list of errands which I need to take a picture of that list and um, I don't have like a ton of stuff. I need to do some work catch up today. And I'm gonna have to go um, where I can get some Wi-Fi in the building. So that is what's going on. But that's a little update for the morning. I'm gonna go get my Uber and then I'm gonna go to the Pilates class. Also, I found I have a free matcha full drink. I got a, like a gift card thing back in March. And so I'm gonna go to matcha full afterwards because it's right around the corner and I haven't been since I came in May to pack up my freshman dorm so that is exciting and yeah happy Tuesday let's get it to Pilates all right hello everybody so I just got home from my morning out it was so fun the Pilates class was so good it was really hard in the mask um being up on the roof in the heat, but I'm glad I did the early class so that it wasn't too hot. I feel like the evening ones would be much worse because the sun has been baking on the heat of the roof all day. But anyway, I walked up to the flower district afterwards after I got a matcha. I had a free matcha card, so um, got my oat matcha with mint iced, so good. Um, and then I walked up to the flower district, my happy place. If you are in need of flowers, for your space in New York, go to 28th Street. It's all wholesale pricing. Certain places are more expensive than others. I went to this one place and I didn't remember the name. I just like know where it is. So I'll tell you all next time what it's called. Maybe I can check my receipt. Um, but their stuff was so cheap and amazing. And then I went to a place called Jamali Wholesale Garden and oh my gosh, their pots and vase supply is amazing and the prices are so good. So I got a really cool bowl to put my lemons and bananas in on the counter and yeah, some plants and flowers. So I'm gonna unpack those and do a little time lapse of me doing that. And then I'm gonna make some breakfast. I haven't eaten yet, so I'm gonna have a smoothie, some toast, I think I'm gonna get a shower because I'm pretty sweaty and then I need to do some work. And then I think later on I'll head out. It's supposed to storm later today, so I'd like to be able to get some work in before um, it, or go out and get my errands done before it storms. So I'm gonna bring you guys over here and set you up so you can see me make my arrangements. need to wash my hands 
this is the best hand soap so this is the Le lava one that i got and this is the hinoki scent and oh my god it smells so good it's kind of like santal 33 but like a little bit different um so it's awesome drizzle of manuka honey on top of these for a little extra immunity boost and yeah then breakfast is served i had my smoothie already and then i'm gonna get a shower so yeah hello everybody welcome back let me turn down this brightness the one thing i love about this apartment is the afternoon light is so nice like around four o'clock it's awesome um but anyway i am back from my day of errands i went and i did some work then i had a little bite to eat and then i went back out i went down to soho because i like the zara down there the best and i wanted to look a long time no zara um i didn't get anything though I practice good self-control but also you can't try anything on right now which is kind of annoying but also good but i just like it's annoying because i don't want to buy stuff and then have to return it because right now it's just a big pain so i also went to aritzia i did get these biker shorts i got the tna or the, the atmosphere shorts but um they're so soft and they're only twenty dollars which I found a pair of gray biker shorts on Old Navy that were cute and they were $20 too. So um, they only had a large, so they're kind of like just comfy like to lay around the house in, work from home. Um, I might shrink them a little bit in the wash, but yeah, they're so soft and comfy. So I'm wearing those and I didn't end up showing you my arrangements. So these are the daisies all potted up and then I put my Palo Santo next to it and then over here move the hydro flask these are the dahlias in the brass vase and then I also while I was out went into CB2 and I got some cloth napkins um, these are linens so I just got two of those um, just so we have cloth napkins um, but we can use those for other things too and they're having a sale so and then I just picked up at Plant Shed this plant. This is called a myrtle. Um, and I've wanted one of these for so long. My mom had one. And um, like Tori Birch keeps them in her house. And I just love how they look. They just add such a like sophisticated but like modern vibe. I don't know. I really like them. And then over here we have the Monstera leaves on my nightstand and I think they look super good so yeah that is the little update for you I also have over here my um bowl with the lemons and limes in it looks so good and then I have these little daisies in this little vase um and then yeah I had some lime water earlier and that's kind of what's going on it was so hot today um I was literally just dying and getting grumpy um i did get a coffee at cafe leon door um while i was out picking up my plant and yeah i tried to go to nordstrom and get another hand soap for the bathroom because i only got one at le lava the other day and i'm using it in the kitchen which is fine um for now but i would like to have a hand soap in both places especially right now with all the hand washing i'm doing so i need to call by um uh, and see if the store down in soho has the one that i want because we're trying to sold out it must be good um so yeah i am going to i need to do some more work uh, i have my first zoom class tomorrow so i need to prepare for that um and yeah that's kind of what's going on the rest of the day 
Um, I will say it's definitely the city. It, like a lot of people are like, how's the city? Like, has it changed? And yeah, it has changed, but like also the energy is still totally here. Um, it's just a lot. It's more exhausting. Like doing things before was exhausting, but now it's really exhausting on hot days when you have to wear your mask everywhere. Um, I was kind of having a minor heat stroke. And so thank goodness Aritzia's dressing rooms were open and I was like, I'm going to try these on because I'm probably going to buy them. And I just need to like stop and be like in a cold room and like drink my water so i did that um but yeah i'm gonna facetime some people and i will see you guys in my next video because yeah that's kind of the rest of the day for me um i'm gonna make dinner might just have my leftover pasta who really knows all right hello everybody so i wanted to quickly talk about some of my favorite um, non-toxic household essentials. And basically, I'm trying to be more zero waste. Obviously, I'm not gonna be 100% zero waste um, because like toilet paper, but I wanted to show you, I just got a package in the mail that I ordered from a company called Blue Land and they're really cool glass cleaning bottles and they come with tablets and you just put the tablet in add water and shake it up and then all you do is reorder the tablets and not consume more plastic cleaning bottles and it's just better for the environment and it actually saves a lot of money so i'm excited to open that up and I all right so this is what it looks like these are the bottles um oh, maybe they're not glass i think they're like plexiglass um so like really thick plastic or maybe they are glass no they're not um but anyway so like glass there's one for glass and mirror and then it comes with these little tabs so these are like biodegradable little packages for the tabs um so there's glass and mirror there is multi-surface is yellow and then there is bathroom which is pink so i am going to fill these up and I will show you what it looks like. everybody happy Wednesday so it is like almost 10 30 now and I got up at like 6 15 today went for a walk got a coffee then I came back and I've been on zoom doing meetings administrative stuff emails all that um, but I just ran back down the stairs to the apartment because I got a delivery my urban outfitters chair that I'm so excited about I've wanted one of these for so long um, so they just delivered it and I'm gonna unbox it and I'm gonna set it up over here in the corner. So I will show that to you in a minute. I'll just do like a little time lapse of me unboxing. Here she is, everybody, the beautiful chair. It looks so good. I'm obsessed with how it looks. I haven't even sat in it yet. Let's see. I mean, it's definitely like, you know, the cane is not like super strong, um, but I feel like if I put like a throw blanket on it, um, it'll be good, but I kind of want it to antique up a little bit too, but I'm so excited about it. So yeah, now I have, I have a lot of work to do today, um, but it's Wednesday, which means it's Union Square Farmer's Market. I didn't get a chance to go on Monday and I kind of want to hit it. So I think I'm going to go down there, run a couple errands while I'm downtown, and then I'll come back up, have lunch and do work for the rest of the day, honestly. So I'm gonna go do that and yeah, I will catch up with you all in a little bit after. I think I'm gonna get salmon too and have 
roasted salmon for dinner, which I need to get parchment paper to put on the roasting pan. So I need to write a note so I do not forget that. But yeah, I will see you guys in a little bit. So I just got dressed. I wanted to just quickly show you guys what I'm wearing today to go out and do some errands It's really really nice out today. It's awesome. I'm wearing these sunglasses. They're from Mulberry and Grand This black tank bodysuit is the brand Stellan from Need Supply. This bag is from Assembly It's my favorite tote bag. If you need a really good tote bag, it has a flat bottom and it's large. Get this one. Um, and then this skirt is from Mango and then my beige is because they're so comfy. So that is the look of today and I'm just really vibing with the setup in here. So that's what's going on. I'm going to put my mask on. I'm going to put my mask on and head out the door. So I just got back from the farmer's market little shopping expedition. Um, it was really successful. I don't really like vlog and talk that much when I'm out, especially with my camera. I just use my iPhone, iPhone usually because I just don't want to draw too much attention, especially right now. Um, it's hard to talk in the mask, all that stuff. So anyway, I just put away, I got some salmon for dinner tonight. I'm making a recipe from Ina Garden. It's a herb roasted salmon. So I will show you the herbs that I got at the farmer's market. I need to get them in water because it has been a few hours, let me tell you. So let's see. I just filled up this mason jar with water to put them in. The thing with the farmer's market is you would think that everything is cashless right now because like cash and coins are dirty, but no. A lot of places have card minimums, and so I ended up spending more than like I needed to to hit the minimum. But um, that's just what just what the deal was. So I got some scallions. Um, these in there. I got some dill. I feel like I'll get. For the dill. So it's just gonna go over there. Like that. I got some greens. I got like spinach and mixed greens. And a um, I have a little bit of spinach, but um, my water. Then I got an eggplant to make some like ratatouille with. Then I got this little tiny baby lettuce, so cute. Um, then I had to go to Best Buy to get a USB adapter. And then, God, this bag is really dirty, wow, that's disgusting. Um, AirPods need to be charged. And then I got a bunch of apples to have on hand. Um, and I'm just gonna keep them in here, honestly. So. There we have everything from the farmer's market. So I'm gonna eat lunch because I haven't eaten lunch and I'm starving. So I'll see you all in a little bit. Right, here is the finished product update the green pan works really well and it cooked so fast so yay and I put some dill on top for a little extra flavor Hello everybody so I was just doing some work catching up I got a shower um, and I am about to install some more water filters into my pitcher I have the Soma water pitcher I'll show you right here the filters you can get on Amazon when you need replacement ones. Um, but I just love this, it's super good. I got it for college last year. It works really well. Um, here are my herbs, here's my mint, my parsley, and then dill, and then cute little flowers. So that's like the little overview for you. Um, so I'm gonna do that right now, and then honestly probably start prepping for dinner. Um, my computer was dying, so I had to come charge it. 
Um, and yeah, so that's what's going on. I will show you, like I said, I'm making the Barefoot Contessa herb roasted salmon for dinner. I'm excited to try my first attempt at like a gourmet thing by myself. Um, so yeah, that is what is going on. And I will catch you all in a little bit when I am making the salmon. salmon is done it looks beautiful and the one thing that my parents taught me to know how salmon or fish mostly salmon though is done is that the white the fat will come out of the sides of it so um looks pretty done to me then we have the sweet potatoes and then i'm having some leftover salad from last night and then i already cleaned up and i have my diffuser going and then i pulled this out so i'm going to clean the kitchen like wipe down the countertops and take out the trash after I eat. But yeah, that is dinner.